Guys, I have some more breaking news for you that has to do with the new Ford Bronco and also the upcoming Ford Maverick. And this is leaked information from an anonymous source uh, with some insider knowledge of what's happening in the future for the Ford Bronco um, and also the Ford Maverick. So let's hit it right off the bat uh, with the Ford Bronco. I don't have any pictures uh, necessarily to go along with this, but it's basically about a hybrid option for the powertrain for the new 2021 Ford Bronco that's going to be coming a little bit later. So Ford did not announce anything about a hybrid system. Uh, this is TFLcar.com. This is when Ford launched the new Bronco. And of course, we did a, a comparison video comparing the specs of, of the Bronco against all the others, uh, like the Jeep Wrangler and the Toyota 4Runner TRD Pro. And when they unveiled the Bronco, uh, they specified two engine options, a 2.3 liter four cylinder turbocharged gas engine, which is basically a Ford Ranger engine with a 10 speed automatic or a seven speed manual or a six plus one manual with a crawler gear. And also a 2.7 liter V6, which is basically a Ford F-150 engine with a 10 speed automatic. So this new Bronco is a little bit more of a truck so kind of a truck based SUV, which is great. But now this new information suggests that will it will also later potentially in 2022 and beyond have a hybrid option. And it kind of makes sense because the world is kind of moving in that direction. The world is kind of moving towards electrification. Um, and this pretend, uh, this specific news has to do with um, a combination of their modular 10 speed hybrid transmission which is currently available in the 2020 and the 2021 Ford Explorer. This 10-speed automatic uh, combines an electric motor inside of it. They call it the modular system. Um, and this modular transmission can be attached to engines that are meant for rear-wheel drive, like the Bronco, like the Ford Ranger, uh, like the F-150, like the Explorer, and some others. Um, so basically what we're seeing is Ford is using the same transmission and the 47 horsepower electric motor that's built in it, into it. Um, in the Ford Explorer, it's made it to a 3.3 liter gas engine, non-turbo. In the upcoming F-150, it's made it to, according to Ford, to a 3.5 liter twin turbo V6. And now this new leaked information says that this um, hybrid electric transmission has made it to a 3 liter V6. And that's all I have right now, three liter V6. So I think what that means to me, it's the three liter um, twin turbo V6 that's also available in the Ford Explorer. Uh, boy, okay, so what does that mean? That could mean a lots of power for the new Bronco. Uh, we're already talking about, you know, the V6, the 2.7 that they announced is rated at 310 horsepower and about 400 pound feet of torque. If they put a three liter twin turbo V6 with an additional 47 horsepower electric motor into this thing, we could see horsepower numbers over 400 horses. That's just my um, you know, assessment of this news. Uh, this didn't come from this source. So we also know that the Jeep Wrangler 392 Hemi, the big V8 is also coming with 450 horsepower. Could this be that Bronco and Ford are planning an answer to that um, in the form of a three liter twin turbo hybrid system, also with close to 450 horsepower in the, what it is, what is, is actually a fairly short four wheel drive vehicle. That would be nuts. I think we're once again in a horsepower war and kind of uh, just powertrain war between Jeep in this case and Ford, uh, which is very interesting. This news also has to do with uh, what's called the Maverick. So here's tfltruck.com, and we were basically the first people to bring you sort of a CAD image of this tailgate, and then kind of this leaked image of a tailgate, what appears to be a pickup truck tailgate that's stamped in the metal that says Maverick. What is a Maverick? Uh, Ford has not released any official information on this yet. There was a prototype recently captured on the streets of uh, Dearborn and around Michigan um, that was kind of a cam camouflaged pickup truck. What we think this is, is a small compact pickup truck 
which is a little bit smaller than midsize, based on the Ford Bronco Sport. Ford also announced the Bronco Sport um, when they announced the Bronco, which is um, a small crossover unibody vehicle that's um, related to the Ford Escape, and it's using some of the same powertrains from the Ford Escape that's currently on sale, except the Bronco Sport it has got a boxy body, it's got a kind of a modified, a unique four-wheel drive, all-wheel drive system, and, and overall, uh, this is basically meant for a little bit more off-roading. Um, so, uh, rumor, rumored that the Maverick is going to be basically kind of a small cab, maybe a four-door cab with a bed extension on it, and it will be called the Maverick, which is very interesting because there's nothing really in the space in the United States which is kind of a compact truck. But then this leak also says that Maverick is coming um, and Maverick will have a hybrid also. And the hybrid will be related to the Escape. And this is, I'm just using Ford.com because this is a specification of the Escape. And if you look on this first column, this is a two and a half liter, uh, not naturally aspirated four cylinder Atkinson cycle engine front-wheel drive or all-wheel drive, ECVT transmission, and total horsepower rating um, of 200 horsepower when you combine the gasoline engine and the electric system um, in it. Um, and EPA ratings down here, I'm sorry, um, of about 44 city, 37 highway, 41 combined. So this is very interesting. If Ford is actually working on a compact truck, which is smaller than the Ranger, and it will share some of the powertrains with Escape and the Bronco Sport, um, and have, we'll have these numbers, 200 horses, about 40 MPG combined. That will be something that nobody offers in the United States, which is very interesting. Could also appear in about 2022 timeframe. Um, and this un uh, anonymous source also said that the Maverick could have a starting price of about $20,000 or 19,995. How's that possible? Well, that's not the hybrid price, I'm sure, but a base, base Maverick little pickup truck that a lot of you I think are probably wanting and have been wanting for many, many years could have an affordable price about 20 grand, maybe a little bit more with shipping costs. Um, and potentially when you load it up with technology, it could have a hybrid as well. Um, I think that's pretty exciting news. So let me know what you think in the comments below. Uh, should, Bron should Ford build a hybrid Bronco with about 450 horsepower? Should they build the Maverick? Should they make the Maverick also a hybrid? Not a plug-in hybrid, by the way, but just a regular hybrid. So let me know what you think. Um, and um, go back to tflcar.com where we have Bronco coverage and uh, Bronco Sport coverage and tfltruck.com where we have Maverick coverage F-150, of course, Raptor, um, and everything else related to trucks. Uh, thank you.